Hey guys, what's up? It's Monk Zonky. So the Abyssal Demon drop table has been updated, um, as well as all other kinds of demons. I will be checking all of them out later in the video, so keep that in mind. Um, but for the initial portion, we're going to be doing Abyssal Demons. So just some tips for what you want to bring. Uh, they do drop a ton of gems, mostly rubies, some diamonds, and quite a few dragon stones as well. So dragon stones are actually part of their drop table because they drop them way too often to not be part of their drop table. Um, they drop a lot of runes. They drop some noted Addy or some uh, some battle staves as well, or um, fire orbs, and basically just a whole bunch of stuff that's like not worth a whole ton but at the same time if you pick it up it can add up over a while um, so what I'd recommend is to bring a yak if you have one and if you don't don't worry about it but for sure bring a gem bag um, because they just drop so many rubies that rubies are 4k each so you want to be picking them up is what I'm saying um, that's almost as good as like a dragon bone when you get it so the abbey demons have been pretty crowded on most worlds uh, this world at the moment is pretty uncrowded is just me and this one other guy at the top floor. I have no idea how rare the wand and the orb are. Um, I imagine it's going to be, it probably will take a couple hours to get a fair chance of getting one, but I do know that the drop rate of Abyssal Whip is um, fairly rare, about like 1 in 500, something like that. Don't quote me on that. I don't know the exact drop rate, but I know it's around 1 in 500. Um, so it will take a while to kill about 500 Abbey Demons if the drop rate for the new wand and orb are about the same. I don't know how much they are in the GE at the moment because I'm not going to buy one and I have not uh, heard any news about how much they are selling for. Yeah, I can't imagine that they're going to have a very high price for very long since they're only a level 75 item and the Chaotic Staff is better and the Virtus Wand and Book are better and they're not worth hundreds of mils. So I don't think that these wands and orbs are going to be worth hundreds of mils, so don't freak out about it. But there's a ruby. They, these things just drop a ton of rubies. Obviously, they drop Infernal Ashes as well, um, which I'm collecting in my urns. So if you don't want to have to make a ton of bank trips and you don't want to have to leave Infernal Ashes on the ground, make sure to bring Infernal Urns with you. And a Spirit Emerald, those are very nice. So um, I'm going to go check out, I guess, Black Demons and uh, Greater Demons as well and show you guys what those are like as well. Alright, so I killed Abyssal Demons for about half an hour. Um, no wand or book or anything, didn't even get any wipes, but these are kind of the drops that you can expect to get, lots of runite ore, lots of fire orbs, lots of pure essence, magic logs, adi ore, law runes, blood runes, death runes, dragon stones, and I have a ton of gems in my gem bag, and I banked a few rune items, I got three rune chains, four rune medium helms, I guess they're just called rune helms now, but yeah, that's what I got, so um, apparently they're about 1.5 mil an hour, uh, more if you bank the ashes, so that's pretty nice I guess but anyway we're gonna check out black demons now and I guess I'll show you what they drop in just a second when I figure it out for myself oh black plate body in the first kill I like how in the behind the scene video when they talked about buffing the drop tails they're like oh yeah we're removing junk items grapes okay uh, these are some pretty odd drops so far <laughs> but black demons dropped a ton of black items um, I guess for Jags, they thought they were funny or something, you know, black demons dropping black items, but they didn't drop black plates, so that's new, but that doesn't make it any less crap. Anyway, two grapes, okay, a rune chain, oh, spirit sapphire. Sorry, I like getting the spirit sapphires. If you don't know what they do, um, when you wear them, they have like a 1 in 10 chance of not using up a charm when you make a pouch. Um, and the spirit sapphires last for 10 charms, the emeralds last for 20, the rubies last for 30. Uh, I think there's diamonds too, but something like that. Anyway, so Spear of Sapphire and a Rune Chain already. I'm just going to kill these for a little while, and then I guess we'll go check out Graders. I'm not sure where the best place to kill Graders is, because I don't have a task, so I can't kill them in the Curdles Dungeon. Chili Potato? Really? Okay, so, so far these drops aren't looking great, but, um, you know, hopefully we'll change things around pretty soon here. Okay, so I figured out, I guess, some of their drops. They're not great. Um, I got a tooth half of a key and unnoted wine of Zamrak. So, um, the wine of Zamraks are at the moment are worth about 6k, but that's just because of the bonus XP weekend. They're not going to be worth that much forever. Um, but even before the bonus XP weekend, they're worth, worth about 4k each because um, I guess a lack of bots collecting them or something like that. Um, so the wine of Zamraks are worth quite a bit. So those. I guess are nice. Um, I got a noted grimy renar, grimy spirit weed, grimy irrit, so it looks like they drop a lot of noted herbs. I got another rune chain body, more grapes, 
noted Addy Bar. So far, the drops just aren't looking spectacular. They look okay. Um, you could probably expect about 400, 500k an hour here, just off of the regular drops, not counting the ashes. But um, don't go crazy. This isn't going to be like a great money task or anything from the looks of it so far. Um, but since Greater Demons are even lower level than Black Demons. Their drops are probably going to be even worse, but we'll go check them out now anyway. Okay, so I've discovered some Greater Demons. I remembered that these wild dogs here, that they are no longer aggressive because, you know, before the evolution of combat, um, these things attacked you. Actually, they didn't if you're level 138, but anyway, yeah, the wild dogs are very low level now, so they won't attack you, Chaos Runes. Uh, they dropped that before the drop table buff so maybe they drop chaos runes in larger quantities now or something addy plate legs they dropped those before the drop table buff too what's going on mithril plate legs they didn't drop those okay but mithril plate legs are a junk item so i'm not interested in those yes i did just bank an addy plate leg they're 3k okay it's all right 3k it's worth it i am so cheap like um uh, if i'm killing a monster for example when i was at abyssal demons um if other people leave stuff on the ground that's worth a fair lot a fair amount i will run around and pick it all up they drop death runes before the evolution or before the uh, drop table buff too so not seeing a whole lot of new items here um i don't think greater demons are going to be great money just throwing that out there phone's ringing oh well okay guys well apparently uh Greater Demons now drop Noted Pure Essence. Oh boy. You know, when they said drop table buff, I thought they meant they are actually going to make these things worth killing, but they didn't, let's be honest. But of course, you can still always kill Zami for your Greater Demon task. Oh, they dropped Grimey and ours too, now too. They never dropped Herbs before, but... So, Greater Demons are now, you know, they were crap, and they're still crap. They might be, you know, 200k an hour instead of 100k an hour. Noted Gold Ore, that's a new item for... Okay, that's not great at all. Um, but anyway, as I was saying before, the phone ringing so rudely interrupted me is, yeah, I'm super cheap. Even though I have, you know, more money than I really could spend at the moment, um, I still will run around and pick up items that are like two, four, two, three, four K that are, if the other people lay in the, on the ground, like at Abbey Demons, I was running around picking up everyone's uncut rubies, um, and stuff like, you know, noted Addy or you know all these runes if people left them on the ground I would run around and pick them up so so far what we're seeing is the Abbey Demon drop tables um, even if you don't get one of those new wands or books or orbs I'm not sure if it's a book or an orb but it's one of the two um, even if you don't get one of those you can still make a fair amount of money per hour killing those things um, black demons are not as great but you could probably still make you know 400 500k an hour Greater demons are still crap. Just either do these because they drop a few crimps and charms if you're a lower level and you need some range XP because they are decent range XP. Um, if you're a higher level, do Zamorak or don't even bother with this task. Um, but that's about all for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you found it informative. And I realize like lesser demons and imps got their drop tables buffed too. But no. Just no. So anyway, farewell.